Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I am going to be finally showing you my new room. This is my uni room. Um, you can't really see a lot of it behind me, but this is it. It's very cute. I'm very happy with it. Um, yeah, I just thought that I would make this intro because I realised I hadn't when I was editing it. So this is the intro. But yeah, if you've got any questions about uni, feel free to leave them in the bottom. To so leave them in the bottom. Feel free to leave them in the comments. Um, I do want to try and do a Q&A, so if you've got any about uni life or about Freshers Week, whatever, because I've just finished Freshers Week, um, feel free to put them below. Um, yeah, I think that's kind of it, really. This is the room. It's really nice. I feel really at home already. I'm really happy with it. If you enjoy the video, give, don't forget to like it and subscribe. Um, and I will see you in the next one. But anyway, without further ado, let's crack on into the room tour. <laughs> So when I shut the door, this is what you can see on the back, um, and then when I turn around, this is the room. <laughs> um, so I've got my light switches here, um, and this is the bathroom. I've then got a doorstop just here, and then I've got a hook with shopping bag, my jacket, and then my bags. So then when I open the bathroom, this is what you can see. I've got my towels on the rack on the door um, and then when you come in I've got my toiletries just down here and then I've got like medicine, um, plasters, light bulbs, stuff like that. Then I've got a bin and then I have my kind of cleaning toilet rolls, um, bleach, stuff like that, air fresheners down there. This is in the toilet, which is just a toilet. Um, and then next to it I have my toilet brush, um, then I've got next to it my bath mat and above da -da -da, is the shower. Um, so the shower, the floor is actually like, it's almost like a wet room kind of, it's not, it's not a wet room but like the floor, like it doesn't really get wet, like it's, I can't really explain it. Um, so this is the shower. And this is what the inside of it looks like. I've just got like a thing there that the only thing about the shower that I don't like is that the walls aren't like tiled. <laughs> um, so they're, they're kind of like, I can't explain it, they're like wool. But the paint obviously is like a special paint that just drips, you know, whatever off. Um, so I can't stick that to the wall, so I might have to put it on the door. But then there's just the shower, shower head. Um, and then I just have body wash there, a razor, and then my shampoo and conditioner at the bottom. Then coming out of the shower, uh, then turn to the mirror. You can see me. The that lighting is very nice. Um, so at the mirror, I just have my like essentials along here. So I've got my mouthwash, a flannel, I've got my flossers, and then I've got my face washes and like cleansing stuff here. I've then got soap. Um, obviously the sink, <laughs> and then I've got my retainer and my toothbrush and toothpaste. Um, so that is basically the general bathroom area. And then above the toilet I have some toilet rolls and then the flush, which is a half flush and full flush. <laughs> and then obviously behind me, as you can see, there are two little hooks just there, and then I've got my dressing gown on it. Um, so yeah, and then when obviously when I come out, I've got my towels, I've got my toe towel, whatever. And then, I'm gonna close the door. But then I've got my wardrobe. Um, this is a nice, fairly doubly wardrobe. Um, it's pretty big in size. So inside on the top, I've got my bed covers, uh, the spares, and then I've got like pajamas. So these are like more t-shirt kind of pajamas and then like normal pajamas. Then I have a rail. It's not very big. I kind of thought it was going to be a bigger rail, but I've just got some skirts, my shirts, things that need to be hung up really. Everything else that can be folded is down folded. And then I've got some coats. And in this one, I have any jeans or trousers, so jeans are up the front, so I've got my black jeans here, I've put my white ones with them, my striped ones with them as well, and then I've got my blue and then like other colour ones, and then the back, I don't know if you can see, I have my trousers, um, yeah, and some trousers down there, then I have lit underwear, 
and socks and stuff and then I have tops so at the front it's quite cramped I'm not gonna lie at the front I've got like normal t-shirts um, and just kind of everyday tops and then at the back there are like more going out tops and kind of nicer tops then on the bottom one I have skirts at the front um, and dresses at the back so these are kind of like going out skirts I guess um, I didn't really have any room for them on the actual rail so I put them there and then I've got dresses there these are more cottony dresses then on this one I have um, my jumpers just on the bottom layer some hangers a hat a swimming costume my gym stuff is at the back you can't see it and then I've got the fur thing that goes on my leather jacket so that is the wardrobe then as you turn this is what you can see I have the laundry bag down there but next to the radiator and then I have a long pretty much floor to ceiling mirror it's really long I can see everything next to it this is the shoe rack that I've got this is the shoe rack that my parents made for me um we basically found old pallets that had just been abandoned on the side of the road and we used those um to make it I have filmed some of the process of making this um so I might make a video out of it if you guys want to see that because it's pretty cool these are just made out palettes um but yeah this is my shoe rack so i've got my trainers on top my heels and my like nicer kind of heels in the middle um and then i've got my boots along the bottom <laughs> then next to it i've got my bag um i just have this there ready so that i can put my stuff in in the morning or the night before and then this is the desk area so this is my desk i'm just going to go from like le layer to by layer so the top layer here I have um, my printer paper and then I've got a box that the university gave us when we moved in. It had some like goodies in it, it had some, um, it had like Fanta and some like chocolate squares and whatever. Um, then I have my cards, some good luck cards from family and friends. Um, and then I've got this little print that my grandparents got for me, just there. Then the next level. I have uh, a plan in this one along with my perfumes so I've got my <laughs> One Direction one, my Beyonce one and then my Vera Wang one and then next to it I have my makeup bag and with some books I've got my scrapbook folder and then just normal books um, so that if I need a notepad I've got one. On the next one I've got a candle that obviously I'm not allowed to light, a shell that I bought in Cornwall and then this uh, picture because it's cute isn't it and it pink it goes with the room then on this one i have my books um and then on top i've got a t-shirt that the uni gave us for one of the nights that they've got coming up um so yeah this is the bookshelf it's very interesting <laughs> then i have my desk my actual desk area so this is the desk area i'm just going to show you along the back um so to start off with i've got um just like some prints and stuff um and then i've got like tickets and that for uni event events i then have my timetable and i've then got a little dream catcher and then i have a whiteboard that i thought would be really useful to put like to-do lists on um then i've got more photos and then i've got my freshers fortnight timetable um i mean to be honest you basically know what you know i'm going to now if you can't see it on there actually you can oh well i'm in Cheltenham at the university of gloucestershire if you hadn't already guessed some people have been commenting it so i thought as well i might as well just tell you um and this bit also actually lights up so i've got a nice little light under there um which is super cute then on the desk i have this little like tray thing that i showed in one of my hall in my uni hall um i've just got like some like stationery in there essential kind of uni stuff that we've got going on some like little post-it notes and whatever then i have um pen pots so i've got my colored pens in this one and then i have just kind of like normal pens and pencils most of these are from the gabby range from primark all this stuff's gabby that's gabby um and then i have a little coaster with me free phantom oh it's spinning um with the free phantom that the uni gave us <laughs> Um, and then towards the back, as you can see, I have um, just this little pot with like clips and stuff, paper clips and push pins that I've used for my board. Um, so yeah, there's those ones there. And then I have my makeup. Um, these pots were obviously from home. This is all from home. So I've got my makeup brushes in this one. Then I've got 
um, pads to take my makeup off with, lip products, I've got my random camera here that I've taken like 10 photos on that were all like by accident. Um, then I've just got my makeup like set up here, my mirror, and then I've got my um, uni pass and three extra coasters in case anyone ever wants to come in and have a cup of tea. Um, so yeah, this is the desk area. So that is what it looks like. It's so cute. And then obviously, I have my MacBook in the middle on its little uh, stand. Um, and then, moving down, I have a drawer and some shelves. I'm not going to lie, I think these should be bigger or I should have more because it's just not really enough. But in this drawer, I've just got my nail stuff here. I've got my eyelashes and any extra like makeup that's loose that I don't really use a lot. Jewellery in the back. Um, my nail lamp and then I've got jewellery here like go to jewellery and some hair stuff down this little bit it's really cramped in here um, to be honest if I brought any more I wouldn't have been able to fit it in so that's that one then moving down I have more makeup um, so in this one in one of these little pots I've got my palettes and then in this one here I've got like um, makeup wipes makeup remover deodorant um, cotton pad thingies, body spray, stuff like that. And then in the bottom one, I have my printer. Um, so this is a Canon printer, I believe. Um, I've just got my printer paper on top and then I've got like a pack of popcorn, the like instruction manual for the printer and then a, like a bigger purse because I use a small one. And then obviously I have the chair that the uni provided. And then underneath the desk, I have my little copper bin. Um, and then on the chair, I've also got like a seat thing. But it doesn't fit onto the chair, so it just kind of falls off, but that's that. So then to the left of it, I've got my window space. This is a massive window that you can open. It's also got a blackout blind at the top. On the window sill, I've just got these three little plant pots. Um, these are all from Ikea. And then I've obviously got my Greenwich Village thing with a bottle of Prosecco in. Um, my other drinks are obviously in the fridge, but it is fresher, so I obviously have alcohol. Um, then along the floor, I just have my extension lead with my cords on. And then I have my TV area. So this is the thing that I've actually filmed for the video that I was going to do. Um, this is also made out of pallets and also something that my parents made for me. Um, so I've just got my TV on top with some fairy lights around. Um, and then underneath I have in the first like slot I've got my vinyl and my vinyls and then my DVDs and then in the next one I have my tripod just on the floor there and then I've got like any tech stuff so I've got my like iPhone box and another tripod and my camera and like my MacBook charger and stuff like that. So that is that and then above it I've just got my Dunkirk poster on the wall with a command strip. Um, then when you turn from this area you can see my bed. Look at it. It is so cute. Um, so this is my bed. On the wall I have this collage that I made with this stuck, uh, stuck up with command strips. Um, so this is the bed cover that was from Asda, I believe. I might be wrong. It's in the uni hall. Um, this is a mermaid blanket that it was grey that I had that I just thought would go perfectly. Then this is the Primark bed cover. Those are my pyjamas on the end there. Um, and then this is obviously the top end. So this is the rose gold cushion that I had with it. Um, this is the Gabby one. And then I've got my fluffy one just there. And the grey one and the Zoella lifestyle one there. And then above the bed, I've got my little really cute area. So I've got my New York print that I bought from Ikea. Um, a little sea candle just holding the lights down. And then I've got another photo in the corner. And then a little plant. Um, and then on the next level down, I've got a lamp that has no bulb in it. <laughs> um, a little photo frame, my Harry magazine, along with like a little jewellery thing. Um, a copper sea, and then I've got my phone charging, my alarm clock, a little coaster that my mum bought me that has my name on it. Um, and then I have a picture of my family. Um, so yeah, that is all of it. I'm just going to like do a little quick montage because it's so cute.